Hi guys, Sam here from the UK customer success team at Vincherry. Just wanted to quickly show you the new candidate merge feature. If you do have two candidates in the system and you want to merge them, simply head to both records, select them both, and then head down to merge candidate. Select this and it'll pop up with the merge candidate selection. You can change at this point if you do want to the candidate, simply delete Annabella Poon and select another candidate. However, if both of these records are correct, simply select next. One thing to note as well that there are certain rules that will stop you merging these candidates. So for example, these six up here, do make sure that you have a quick read. Vincherry, for example, will not merge availability data. The availability of the master record will be kept and files, applications, placements and invoices will be appended into master records if you select the append options with just below. You can deselect these. As a default, the first selected candidate will be used as a master, so you can change this and select the secondary candidate as the master. You can also decide which information that you do want to keep for each record. So for example, you'll note here for date of birth, the secondary record or the secondary candidate does have a date of birth, whereas the first doesn't. We can simply select this and that will be used in the master record. You can also overwrite this data. So as far as we are aware, this is the only system that gives you this much control over when you're merging a candidate. For example, if you didn't want to use either of these names and you wanted to create your own one, you would simply select this, edit data, and you type in Bella or any word that you did want to use. You will also see that you can append data. So from both records, if we scroll down, you'll see candidate brief just here. You can decide to add both of them. This means that both sets of data for both the primary and the secondary will be added to this master record. If we scroll down and we know that we've got all the right data and all the information that we do want, we can simply select merge. This will then tell you that this action cannot be undone. Are you sure you want to merge these? We select yes. And this will begin to merge these candidates. To actually view the merge, what we can do, simply head into the merge tracking tab, which is just here and that will show you exactly where these candidates and what stage they are. For example, here we've got status done. To head back into the candidates, we can then view the unwanted candidate. If we simply head into the archive candidates just here, and here you'll be able to find the secondary and the unwanted candidate. Cheers guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you do want any other help, then please do head to the help center uh, and we'll be more than happy to help. Cheers.